Hi, this is Mato. Welcome to my online chess lecture. In this video, I will show you a game between Mikkel Tal and Anthony Miles. This amazing chess game was played in Pors. In 1981, Mikkel Tal had white pieces and he started with e4. Anthony Miles played c6, d4, d5, the Karo Khan defense. Knight to d2. D takes on e4, knight takes on e4, knight to d7, intending knight from g to f6, knight to f3, knight from g to f6, offering to exchange knights, knight to g3, not exchanging pieces, e6, bishop to d3, bishop to e7, queen to e2, and both players cast at king's side, b6, intending bishop to b7 and c5. Tal played c4, bishop to b7, bishop to f4, rook to e8, rook from a to d1, lining the rook with the black queen, c5, attacking white center, d takes on c5, b takes on c5, and now knight to e5, black to move, queen to b6 was played. If knight takes on e5, then bishop takes on h7 check, and after knight takes on h7, rook takes queen. Back to our game. So Anthony Miles played the queen to b6, moving the queen to a safe spot. White to move. What would you do in this position if you had white pieces? Please pause and find the best move for white. Did you pause? What did you find? There was a big surprise. Mikkel Tal played bishop takes on h7 check. Black to move. Knight takes on h7. If king takes on h7, one line goes like this. Rook takes on d7. Knight takes rook. Queen to h5 check. King to g8. Queen takes on f7 check. King to h7. Knight to h5, threatening check mate on g7. Bishop to f8. Knight takes on d7, attacking the bishop, which is defending the pawn on g7. Let's play a few more moves, king to h8, knight from h to f6, threatening queen to g8, checkmate, pawn takes knight, knight takes on f6, threatening queen to h7, checkmate, bishop to g7, queen to h5, check, bishop to h6, queen takes bishop, checkmate. Back to our game. To avoid this variation, knight takes on h7 was played. Tal played rook takes knight g6. If something like rook from a to c8, then queen to h5 is winning. g6 preventing queen to h5. b4. Bishop to c8. If queen takes on b4, one line goes like this. Knight takes on g6, f takes on g6, queen takes on e6 check, and white is winning. And if c takes on b4, then bishop to e3, attacking the queen, queen to a5, knight takes on g6, f takes on g6, rook takes on b7, and queen to g4 could be next. Back to our game. Bishop to c8, attacking the rook. What is the best square for the rook? What would you do in this position if you had white pieces? Tal played pawn takes pawn on c5, attacking the queen. Queen takes on c5. Knight to e4, attacking the queen and getting the knight closer to the black king. Queen to b6. White to move. Perhaps white should move the rook, which is on d7. What is the best square for the rook? Tal didn't move the rook. He played queen to f3. Queen to b2. If bishop takes on d7, and one line goes like this. Bishop to e3. Attacking the queen, let's say queen goes to a safe spot, and then queen takes on f7, check. King to h8, knight takes on g6, check, mate. Back to our game. Queen to b2, white to move. Perhaps white should play rook to c7. This looks like a sensible move, doesn't it? But Mikkel Tal doesn't like sensible moves, he likes killer moves. Knight takes on f7. Queen to g7. 
What happens if king takes on f7? How would you continue now? Then bishop to e5, discover check, and white is winning the black queen. Back to our game. Queen to g7, knight to h6, check, king to h8, and now rook to c7. A quiet before the storm. Rook to f8, pinning the bishop on f4. What is the best way to unpin? What would you do in this position if you had white pieces? White played a move and black resigned, and the move is... Kaboom! Rook takes on e7. Miles resigned in view of this continuation. Queen takes rook. Bishop to e5 check. What now? Queen to g7. Bishop takes queen is possible. Perhaps queen to c3. Knight to f6. Knight takes on f6. Rook takes on f6. Bishop takes on f6. And I guess we can stop here. What do you think of this game? And that is all. I hope that you enjoyed watching this video. I wish you good luck with your chess. And bye for now.